Yes, we have it. We have the Ferrero Rocher chocolate bar. Yeah, I thought I'd give it a try. So why not? It seems like a good idea. Because um, yeah, the ambassador is spoiling us even more now by giving us it in bar form. So this is the dark. We're going to pop it open. Inside is this foil wrap loveliness in the sky. Oh, tear line. Interesting. Should we crack them open first? I think we probably will have to. Possibly. Maybe. Yeah, it's always weird they got this heat seal thing, but hey, eh, it's okay. We're going to... Yeah, we're going to do something. We're going to tear it a little... No, we're not. We're being awful. Whilst I'm making a complete hash of all of this, there is a small thing. Let's just do this. Let's just do as directed. Could you possibly uh, subscribe to my channel if that's entirely something you feel so inclined to do? See that side? I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just fumbling and bumbling and generally being silly. Um, also, whilst you get to experience this whole debacle, could you comment, like, share? Share about somebody who's making a really bad job of opening a chocolate bar. That'd be real news for the internet. <laughs> Um, uh, uh, hold on, here's a bit. Drop it out. There you go. So, that, yeah, they've done the Ferrero Rocher -y bit, and it's in the middle, and so... Definitely smells nutty, more nutty than chocolatey. So, we're going to crack a piece off. Oh, that's quite soft. It's really soft. I think it's because it's got, as you can see, if it will focus, and it's got a core. Hmm, let's dive in. Hmm. So we've got a dark chocolate outer layer. And then there's a chocolatey interior with little hazelnut pieces. Yeah, it gives the idea of a Ferrero Rocher in bar form. I know these have been around for a little bit, and there's like three of them. I thought I'd give the dark one a try because I do like the dark chocolate. But yeah, this is really rather good. Hmm, nice bar. Um, dark chocolate kind of twins with the what's on the inside, and the hazelnutty pieces are there, and it's not too nutty, which is fine for me because I'm not the biggest nut fan. Otherwise, yes, definitely give this one a go. This one is a good bar, so recommended, definitely a recommendation. So do you want to know details? Where, how, what, why? So let's close it back up so you can see in the back, so you can see the ingredients. And I will put the, yeah, let's put it that way. So. This Ferrero Rocher, dark 55% star star, 50% coca shell, because it's on the outside, hazelnut, came from Lidl. This was £1.49. I was going to tear that bit, but I managed to open it up carefully so I could do this bit this way around, which is stunningly interesting. And then you can put it away. So, ingredients here. Other blood. More blub? Blub. Wait. Hmm. So yeah. That's the Ferrero Rocher Dark. Thanks for watching. Um, something else for tomorrow for you to take your, a look at. Yeah. If you can do that, you can wait until tomorrow. You can do that. Otherwise, I have more videos around here you can pass your eyes over. Till then. Laters.